Hey Psych2Go viewers, it's Donna, and today we're going to be talking about 10 effects growing up with a single parent can have on a child. Number one, children tend to achieve less in school. The lack of financial support from a second parent can lead the other to have to make ends meet, which may mean the child can receive less attention and support. Number two, children can experience emotional effects. Children from single parent families were twice as likely to experience mental illness, suicide attempts, and alcohol abuse. Number three, step siblings. It may be distressing for a child when their single parent wants to start a new relationship. They may not like their new guest or feel very overprotected of their parent. Number four, it can permanently alter your brain structure. In a test with mice, it was found that those who grew up without a father in particular had a variation in brain development, particularly in the prefrontal cortex, responsible for social and cognitive abilities. This provides a biological explanation for the aforementioned increased risk of substance and alcohol abuse. Number five, their views on relationships can change for the worse. Their only experience of relationships is witnessing a failed one. Because of that, their general overview of relationships may be bad. Number six, the child may mature quickly. The difficulties they experience in childhood will prepare them for the hardships later in life. Number seven, a stronger bond is built between parent and child. Being in a difficult situation stimulates emotional discussion, allowing both parent and child to be honest and openly understand how the other is feeling and coping. Number eight, step families aren't all that bad. Anderson found that, despite popular belief, an adult is more likely to invest more in a stepchild in order to convince their new partner that they are a good provider. Number nine, it allows the child to escape potential conflict. All too often, the reason a child has a single parent is because of breakups and divorce. Having separated parents means you are far more likely to have a calmer, happier household and parents, with less arguments and outbreaks. Number 10, there is often a huge network of support. In many cases, members of the extended family will help out and become a significant part of the child's life, whether that's grandparents, aunts, uncles, neighbors, and even community support groups. That's the end of the video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and check out the article below for more information. While you're at it, subscribe to the channel. Also, check out my channel. I do psychology videos as well and weekly vlogs. Question of the day, what kind of household did you grow up in? And how do you think it affected you?